This is calculator question number seven from practice test seven in the 2018 College Board prep book. It's also the October 2016 SAT. College Board gives us a scatter plot with a line of best fit, and then they ask, based on this relationship, what is the relationship between a planetoid's average distance from the sun, that's the horizontal axis, and its density, which is the vertical axis. Choice A is planetoids that are more distant from the sun tend to have lesser de densities. As we go more distant from the sun, the density values are going down, so that looks correct. Choice B, planetoids that are more distant from the sun tend to have greater densities. But no, as we get more distant from the sun, the density is decreasing, not increasing, which we saw when we considered choice A. Choice C, the density of a planetoid that's twice as far from the sun is half the density of that other planetoid. So let's look at two specific distances. How about point 0.8 and 1.6? At point 0.8, our density is predicted to be 5. At 1.6, our density is predicted to be more than 4. More than 4 is not half of 5, so choice C is not correct. And choice D, the distance from a planetoid to the sun is unrelated to its density. When we look at this scatter plot where there's a very strong negative correlation between distance and density, we know that that is not correct. The only choice that matches our graph is choice A, so that would be our answer. In this sort of question, I'd like to cross out wrong answers until only one option is left. Come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.